Hey guys, Silence here. Uh, welcome back to another Uta Macros Gacha video. Before we begin, I'm gonna do a little bit of an announcement. So most of you guys who are currently on Macross Space Time The Culture, you probably know by now. Yes, I will be shutting down the group. Um, today, as of this time that I'm recording, it's the 5th of May 2020. I will be shutting the group down at midnight on basically 6th of May 2020 but do not fret it only just means that the fan base material you know like the fan arts and all this kind of thing is going to disappear but where can you actually still follow me um, for all the official Macross information well, basically, you can find me on my YouTube Facebook page, if you guys didn't know. Yes, that page exists, and the link has always been in the description in any of my video's descriptions. So, click that link right now and follow me on my official YouTube Facebook page. I'm definitely going to post up all future official Macross information there. So like the um, round 2 for the Valkyrie 4 Flies merchandise, uh, I did post up round 1 on the cross space time the culture but because the group is closing down, I will mo be moving all my um, round 2 information to my YouTube Facebook page and of course let's say for example if they announce the official events uh, dates you know, like professional, fashionable Macross, um, Valkyrie Fourth Life, the Macross Delta movie. If it's still coming up, <laughs> and all all the other good stuff that Kawamori and team decides to release in the future. So yes, guys, do follow me there. Let all your other Macross fans know because apparently people don't really read <laughs> whatever I type in the group. Uh, well, a uh, majority don't, only a handful of you do, <laughs> so let them know, spread the news, yes, the information on my YouTube Facebook page is shareable, unlike Macross FaceTime the culture, um, the group was set to private, you know, due to reasons, so anyway guys, that's it for the announcement, yes, make sure you follow me on my YouTube Facebook page, links in the description down below once again. So anyway, let's dive into the brand new gacha that belongs to Reina. So let's see if Reina's episode play. Well, we can spice things up for Makina's 7 star episode play. So here we are. Lots of women power being displayed on the background for her fully evolved episode play. Actually, I prefer the pre-evolved image way better, although it looks like you know, Reina is, you know, on the ground, injured, that kind of stuff. But still, it's still way better than this. I mean, it's colorful and all, but somehow it's kind of like a disturbing image to me. I mean, the words are empowering, yes, but somehow or rather, it, it doesn't impact me as much um, as the pre-evolved image does. This one, this one feels like, you know, something out of a theatre performance. And yeah, it's pretty impactful, you know, considering the flowers and of course the petals all over the ground. Your classic, I guess, Romeo and Juliet setup style of theatre performance where someone has to die. But you know, like all the interviews that happened with Kawamori-sama, um, Makina was supposedly to die in the cross delta, but instead they shifted it to uh, rest in peace, uh, Messer. <laughs> so um, it has always been a tradition that you know a Macross character will die in every generation, and it happened to always be following a pattern that it's always a pilot. So Kawamori actually wanted to change things up with Delta, where a diva actually dies so Makina was actually the initial choice 
if you guys didn't know. So some macro specs right there. So anyway guys, let's take a look at Reina's brand new plate and see how it fares. So 3857 total score. Ah, a bit more on charm. I guess the current event song requires that. Um, but still, pretty good stats all around on soul and voice. So yep, pay attention to the three other divas who can use this plate. Surprisingly, Min Mei is there. Because I definitely do not sense a hint of Min Mei in Reina at all. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe because this time around the event main well, episode plates given by the event does have Makina and Reina wearing Min Mei's classic um, Nyan Nyan restaurant's China dress. So, ah, who knows? Anyway, center skill. Units total is boosted by 30% up. Not the best center skill out there, so you can probably expect this episode plate to be a live skill support. Alright, for active skill, for 15 seconds, you have an easier time tap tapping your notes. Live skill? Wow. So more of these kind of episode, episode plates, basically powering up um, score repeat skills. So yeah, your score repeat skills are now boosted by 60% up, so fantastic stuff. Um, if you guys are still into the meta life skill, which is the score and damage, I guess score and repeat is kicking score and damage in the ass now. <laughs> Considering that it reactivates every 30 seconds and now that it's getting a boost by episode plates like these, Score and repeat is king. Uh, well, at least if if you had one of these episode plates. So yeah, so last page. Eh, eh, kind of expected. So far, none of the episode plates with that life skill have gotten a special note treatment. Uh, treatment. So yeah, uh, till the day that it comes. So with all that said, total score pretty decent amount. Um. A life skill that doesn't earn high score on its own. I would give this a uh, good to have episode plate grading. Um, definitely not the best out there, but you know the stats are still pretty good itself. It can be just used for the stats, but you know having that skills to support its um, usefulness is definitely going to come a long way. But considering that this boost another live skill, it's pretty okay. Like I said, it's something to have, good to have in your arsenal, but not the first thing to go to when it comes to, you know, base, uh, building a basic build up for your Divas uh, episode play setup. So yeah, with all of that said, definitely I would like to try to get this play just for the costume points for Re Reina's brand new costume. Uh, of course, you know, if I can do it within the first 10 episode plate pool that is discounted. Um, considering that my luck for Makina 7 star episode plate has been horrible. Hopefully all the bad luck has washed off. So let's do this guys. Hopefully we get something good this time around. Okay. Seems like my loading speed has... Come back to a decent quickness. And the bad luck still carries on. <laughs> That's just horrible. Oh, we do get one red box on the first bling, but it retains on the second. I don't know. Things are not looking good. Oh! I'm I'm happy! <laughs> okay, I got costume points. Um well, it evolves. <laughs> so that's pretty good. Wow! Okay, even if that red box doesn't evolve to Reina's main brand new plate, I I think I have a decent amount of points. It, it will definitely not reach the halfway mark, but considering that the amount of free pools we are getting, wow, they're really tossing in all in. Uh, yeah, considering that we are getting a lot of Three episode plate pools right now. Um, I've gotten quite a bit of, you know, episode ops. 
um, recently. So I should be able to unlock Reyna's costume. You know, just by feeding episode ops. But, you know, it's definitely the most expensive way to do so. Um, so, I don't know. Let's let's try. Let's try to unlock Reyna's costume right now. I don't know how things will go. But I should be able to. So let's dive into the Diva page. Of course, the episode list. Because it's the fastest way to access all these episode plates. Or rather, it's the only way to access these episode plates. Because they only just give costume points and nothing else. Okay. So 150 points just from the main page. And of course, the secret page. Or rather, secret board. Wow, that's just 20 points. This is a very expensive boost in points. 20 points for 4 of the large materials. Okay. And here we go, our 150. Yeah, definitely a long way from unlocking the costume. Okay. So we still need 1,030. Do I have enough hops for this? Yeah, looks like it. Whoop. Okay, I can reduce it to 8. That's a very expensive amount. Ow. Oh boy. Okay, so let's see. I can toss in one medium and two small ones. And we're good to go. One, two. There we go. Exactly 1,200. And here it is. Reyna's brand new costume. I am actually loving the belts. <laughs> they they make such a lovely pattern, like you know, checkers, a chessboard. Um, yeah, and the dress is actually pretty nice. I, I, I okay. I'm gonna be very honest here. I'm I'm a sucker for gothic lolly. <laughs> I love lace. Uh, anything that has lace attracts me. So yes, this costume of Reina's is definitely a thing for me. Even even the one that Mikumo has is very lovely as well. It's the same series type of costume. So I'm I'm sure you guys know which one I'm talking about. If you guys don't know which one I'm talking about, you you really need to start unlocking your costumes. Um, so yeah, all right. So I I'm I've decided, considering that my bad luck is still rolling on a bit, and I I actually tried pulling Makina's gacha yesterday as well. I ended up spending, um, I would say, two thousand stones yesterday, and I got nothing. So hopefully Reina's gacha pool was the last of the bad luck. So we're gonna try this again while it's still available right now. Uh, I mean, the gacha is gonna be here till the 10th of May. So I've got literally uh, 4 more days. Uh, considering that it's gonna be 30 minutes more before the game resets to a fresh day. So I'm gonna put it as 4 more days. <laughs> so I, I mean, I could spread out my pools. Maybe I can do 10 now and 10 tomorrow. Hopefully, eventually, I might get Makina's episode plate. So let's do this. I'm gonna do one more 10 plate pool with Makina's gacha. Hopefully, something nice happens for you guys to see. I'm a bit nervous right now. It's a lot of money going down the drain. Okay, we get some very quick, decent loading. Here we go. Uh oh. I guess today is still not the day! Uh, oh god, okay, one red box on the first week. Oh, this is just horrible. How many pools does it actually take to refresh the bad luck? Ah. Okay. 
Okay. Where is my only red box? Here it is. No evolution. Uh god dang it. <laughs> oh horrible, horrible. Okay. So as always, this is just not my day. Uh, I have no idea when I'm gonna have my good luck back again. But I am always hopeful, you know, gotta be optimistic, gotta hope that Makina comes around to bless us. She is the only 6 star plate, or rather 7 star, depends on how you want to mention the animated plates. So yeah, she is the current only plate that I do not own out of all the 7 stars right now. So I am really really hoping to get it, um, yeah. One thing is the costume. Uh, the second thing is probably I want that doll. I want I want to make a room in my decor page with just all the seven star exclusive dolls. <laughs> oh, I want to do it so badly, but it's it's just too much on the wallet. <laughs> anyway, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys stayed through the whole video, let me know by commenting in the comments down below. And of course, if you enjoyed yourself, hit that like button to this video. Share this video so that others may know that I'm shifting my original Macross content to my YouTube Facebook page. And I'll see you guys in another gacha video. Or maybe even a tutorial one. Soon. Till then, bye!